You are live. We are live. We are live. Hold on. Make sure I'm muted. Well, that's a heck of a lag. Oh my goodness. Oh, I am muted. That's 19 seconds. Wow, for the lag? That's mine was, minute, yeah. I gotta, I'll be right back. I gotta run upstairs and grab something real quick. Okay, you run upstairs and grab something real quick. I have to turn my iPad on here. So it Hello, start. anyone out there? Hello. Right. I can't see chat yet to know if anybody's out there. Nope, I don't see anyone. Okay. Not yet. Oh, there's Big Mama. Hello, Big Mama. Hi, Big Mama. Your cuz just ran up the steps. Why? Uh, her and Debbie are cousins or something. Hey, hey, cuz. Hey. What's up, Eddie? Hi, Tinga T. All right, let's find YouTube. Debbie, your cousin's here. Hi, cuz. I said, hey, cuz. Did you? I didn't even hear you. <laughs> Make sure my volume's turned Hey, Dar, on. how are you? Hi, Ange. Hey, Biddy. Hi, did everybody have a Merry Good Christmas? Christmas? Good Christmas, everybody. Hi, Michelle. Hi, Tina T. Hello, hello. Well, we were just discussing these things. CD things. I don't like them. Me either. And uh, Deb concurred. And Laurel loves them. I love them. <laughs> There's the messy palette again. For real. I know who oh, that name is. Oh, no. Oh. Big Mama. Oh, She's no. Sick. Big Mama. You feel better. Oh, geez. Yes. Feel better. It's this crappy weather. This weather's blah. I've been watching the uh, the Facebook. There's a little th hey Lori B. Hi hi hi. Uh, there's a thing going around that says, "Oh sure, you want to be all nice and springy now when you just killed almost killed us last week." <laughs> uh huh. Let's see. Well, you do that. You can't see who's in the video. Uh, the but we don't have our names up. We don't have our names up. That's Do I you. have it where our names don't come up? Oh, darn. You um, have to click it. Yeah, you up. must have it turned off or okay, something. Okay, hear me waving. That's uh, Michelle 1L. Next to me is... Diane is the messy the messy palette. Diane. Messy palette, Diane. We figured you out. <laughs> um, and below, <laughs> it's like, here's the story. Um... Is Laurel. Color, well, my nails aren't purple today, so we won't look at them. But yes, I have my purple mat. And my iPad's <laughs> not joining in for some reason. <laughs> it's just spinning on my iPad. There we go. That's no, a, a thing. What? Oh, yeah, it's a thing. Oh, there you go. There's our names. There <laughs> we go. It's we a thing. Now. There you go. Of course, I went down that rabbit trail till three o'clock in the morning. Thank you, Michelle. Which rabbit trail? Rabbit trails of making all kinds of envelope thingies. Oh, and I organized my whole drawer of envelopes by size. Oh, I just, I can't, I can't, I can't. Are you serious, Laurel? You just really? Yes, I organize them by size so the next time I need two big, one medium, one small, I know where to grab from now. Here, come organize these because I just went and got these. They were in a big old box. They're these vintage envelopes. There yeah. you go. Those will work because she ends up cutting her envelopes anyway. And I watched um, I Carol, one of them. Carol make it, and she actually does hers backwards. That's where a little bit of the confusion comes in. Um, Genevieve actually does hers a better way to where you don't have the sizing problem that Carol Laws had, but. I did follow it and I did it add an extra flip to mine than she had in hers. So um. so as we were saying, everybody does it different. 
Yes, everybody does it different. So that means no matter what, they'll be fine. Yes, they'll be fine. Go ahead, Michelle. You have a project you're working on. I'm just doing my own thing. So you go tell everybody what you're working on. Oh, me? Yes, you. Oh, I'm just I'm just making a, a ring binder. And oh. I just was telling Debbie, uh, like, this is one of my ephemera pieces for it. Oh, uh -huh. cute. It's uh, a piece of packaging. Do you remember those paper clips that Michelle had at her last sale? Okay, yeah. first of all, those things rock. They're way better than some old. I could actually get them on a page, and I don't hate them. Because when I opened them out of the box, I was like, ha! But I love them. But this is the packaging from it. And I just put two pieces of muslin down and um, a piece of lace and sewed around it. And then she's going right. to go on it somehow. But I, uh, she's on a bag. I've been using these bags, these little oh, bags nice. right here, and cutting off the tops and yeah. using them for pocket pockets, tags. Nice. Like it's on this girl right here. Nice. She's on a bag. Just gives it a little bit more stability. Hey, thank goodness for my little sister who was able to get me Tamiflu. Got sick on my B day. Oh yeah. I had both, Angie. I had A and B and pneumonia all at one time. It's a lot of fun, isn't it? Yes, you did. Hey, KK. Well, feel better soon. Oh, my goodness, Angie. Right, Michelle? You knew I would. Yeah, my the drawer I just organized is 16 by 15 by 8 inches deep. And it just was jam-packed full of junk mail envelopes filled. <laughs> Seriously? I have I have a bag of them. I just don't know what I did with them. They're in a bigger bag. Like I put them in all in a big envelope, junk mail envelope, and then I yeah. shut them all in, and they were in my scrap bucket and I don't know why I moved them. Why do I move things? I well, why do I move things? I just can't find something I'm looking for right now either. Yeah, <laughs> but I, I can find everything. It. Well, we all know that you need a GoPro. Right. Well, I'm better now because then I can see everything, but I'm still having issues because I rearranged everything. Yes, Tamiflu <laughs> is amazing, but you have to get it within the first three days. Hi, Christina. How are you? Hi, Lori B. There you go, Angie. Typed it in right after I said it. You have to get it within three days. I'm trying to make sure I didn't miss anyone. Cheshire Cat. I know who that is, too. That's who is Star. Star. Oh, thank you. Was that two L's or one L? I was going to say. <laughs> Hi, Tammy. How are you? I haven't had a sale in a very, very long time. So if you just opened that box, you've been staring at it for a while. So I've been organizing all of Tracy's digitals that I have printed. I have some of Compendium, Compendium 2, Compendium Dark. I don't have them all printed out, which makes no sense. But I have this one piece right here. I'm trying to figure out which digital it came from, where it came from. Because I need to know. Yeah, I need to know. So I've been going through, well, which will take me hours. Let me click on you and let me see if I can recognize. It'll take me hours to go through all of her digitals to try and figure out that heavy. To try and figure out which one it is. Because I have so many sitting it's an here. Older one. Yeah. What the heck is that? I don't know. It could be a freebie. It could have came from the freebies from one of the um, Foxy Rags. It could be any of those. I don't know at the moment. So I'm trying to figure out. I, I just like to know where they came from. So. Yeah, I don't know where that is. What that yeah. is. No, I'm, 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 I'm not sure myself. One. It looks like a bunch of different ones put together. I see like oddments. I see masterboard. Right. I see that flower, that botanical is like sketch drawn botanical. That's why I think it's a freebie because it's like a a collage, a tear page. Yeah. Could be it's like a tear page. I'll figure it out. She also says oddment question mark. Uh. It Oh, I heard somebody's horn. Someone's alarm. It's out of time, I have. Angie, did you just say sausage? 
Oh, geez. No. I a sausage I, brain. I don't need sausage sick. anymore. Come on. Okay, yeah, it's Joe awesome. said, my could be. Admins. Yeah, it could be admins. Okay. So. I will go look. This Hello, little, everyone, by the way. Ringy my thing. I just realized I was telling Debbie before, before we came on that I have all my papers picked. But I just realized I can't have pages like this. So now I have to tear all these because they have to be straight pages. So the book will flip. Duh. You can't have pages like what? Like Sorry. folded in half pages. In a ring bound because like we're going to oh. do the whole thing. Yeah. It's like, right. Now I have to do all this. Well, and you so can have two. You would just have to stack them instead of put them all together. You know what I'm saying? You'd have to stack them. Oh, just, yeah. I put the holes and then put them in the ring binder. Yeah, like a, yeah, that. Yeah. Yeah, I get it. I don't think it'll open. I don't know. I don't think it'll open right. But also, I can change my mind, which, let's face it, I really do that. And stick them all together and do a no bind uh, journal and just put a piece of sorry silk through and then put it together with two pieces of lace and make it that way. I could do that. You could do that. I could do that. You could do that. You I totally could do that. But then I couldn't put my cool things in. That's so cool. Well, I could. I could do that. You could do that. I could do it. I could do it. I found some old glassine that had stamps in them. And the stamp stuck. So now I just have pieces. Oh, I know what I wanted to tell everybody. Um, Do tell. Christmas Eve. I usually get on here every Christmas Eve. My bad. I did not. That is my youtube anniversary so i now am in my seventh year i just finished my sixth year on the 20 my very first video was on christmas eve six seven years seven years ago i'm in my seventh year i'm starting my seventh year on youtube yippee yay my so, youtube anniversary was so. yesterday really and i'm starting my Fifth year. I just finished my fourth year. Yeah, it was. You go, Deb. Yesterday, right. Was right. My, yesterday was my late husband's birthday, and in honor of him, that was my first video. That's yes. Oh. That's right. So yes, I so meant. We have lots of anniversaries. Yeah, Laurel's is until April. We'll have to Mine celebrate April Laurel. Thirteenth. That Laurel's is in April. I remember April, that. Six years, April thirteenth. Yep. And mine is just beginning my seventh year. Unbelievable. That's a long time. Seven years. I'm just pondering that right now. <laughs> Like, what the hell? No, it seems so much longer because, you know, life has gone by. Like, Cam's been through middle school, high school. College. I'm like, how could I only be on here six years? Yes, Angie, we have been friends for yes. seven years. Same with exactly. Laurel. Same with Laurel. Yep. And Abby. Yes, we are. I just talked to Abby this morning, actually. How is she? She's good. She's good. She's good. I was uh, congratulating her. She just posted um, three journals and they all three sold. I was like, uh, you go, girl. Yeah. Well, I was just watching her videos. You know? Yeah, I was like, hey. That's good like job. a Tammy Hallwood said, I think Laurel was the first crafty channel I watched. I believe so, too. So she's been with you from the beginning. Yeah. Mine is uh, Patty Wilborn. 
I have known her. She was one of my very, very first people. Friends glued together. <laughs> right. <laughs> That's about how it was, Sandy. Seriously. <clears throat> okay, I don't know what I want to make for, like, the cover of this. I wanted to put just a cabinet card. And I know this is the size I want to use. You guys, I have so much before on my floor right now. It's not even funny. Oh, I'm getting ready for Stock Your Stash. That'll be on the 7th. So I hope everybody will be there. It's coming up. Yeah, that's Saturday. Um, <coughs> Stock Your Stash con concept is everything you wanted to try, but maybe not wanted to buy. So I buy it in bulk and you get to try it. And if you like it, then you can go buy yourself. And you'll be like, oh, it is worth that. So let's go get it. Or you can buy enough from Michelle where you don't have to go buy it yourself. Right. Yeah. Or you can buy it. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I'll let me tell you, I'm so tired. I'm really tired of counting to 10. <laughs> uh, yeah. Michelle says, pack a lunch, y'all. Yep. Long day. Long, good day. Good long yeah. day. Yeah. I know I'm telling you, I did. Okay. You guys remember all that? Um, I had all that embroidery floss and all those seam binding things. That whole oh, yeah. Thing. Yeah, I have all that. I, ha I made something out of that. Because <laughs> remember, I just put it up there and everybody just went crazy. So I was like, let's not kill my mod. I will repack all this and make bundles. <laughs> so, yes, counting to 10. Unreal and Jade will come in the room and he'll go, seven. Five and I'm like, I hate you. Stop it. It's like, I love to do that to people when they're counting. It's like oh, my favorite thing. I do that to you, the Ralph. Yeah, well, it doesn't mess me up, but I love to mess other people up. Yes, it never messes you up. No, it never, it never messes you. Up. Okay, I need to start doing something. I'm just yammering I'm just away over here. Piece of paper because I'm mixing different things together. So, um. Yeah, okay. I know I'm using this piece, and I don't know where this piece came from either. I can't find this one yet either, which is That's so weird. Do a flippy. What if I hold on? How many pieces I got here? One. Wow, this is all messed up. Oh, this smells so good. Oh, that's a little piece of tissue out of an. Hey, old... can you make me a cup of two? Because mine's just about empty. <laughs> One, two, three, four, five. Debbie, because Debbie will have hers done before I get my stuff printed out today. Because she's just tearing and ripping away over there. I'm making... I'm making Makes me crazy. These are all like leftover papers from other projects. Yeah, I think I'm going to pull out my scrap in too and use a bunch of those. Because I've been wanting to do that. I'm just going to make them small enough to fit in the little doomahickey. Dumahickey? New word. Dumahickey? Dumahickey. 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 under admins right now and see if it's in there. Floppity, floppity thing it's got to be a freebie, Laurel. I don't know. Well, I can't find this one either. I know it's only a piece of one. But I can't yeah, they almost one. broke you, Michelle. Oh, my goodness. I believe no it is admins. I'm. It looks like the same colors. Same. Yeah, it's I'm pretty sure it's oddments. Yep, it is. Ta-da! There you go. This Thank you, Michelle. So now I'll have to print out a bunch of all those because I'm going to use them both. So. All right, I decided that's what I'm doing. Is it one? Thank you so much, Michelle. Yep, I love the oddments. All right, I'm going to do two. I can write that on here. All right, there's eight pieces of paper in each one of those. Well, we need more. Okay, some vellum. And where is my. Okay. 
Do I want to use these? What am I looking for here? Could use them as a flip out. Oh, hey. Motorcycle man. Hello, motorcycle man. Sounded like him. And I need to print out Dark Compendium because I don't have any of those. We are going to mix and match some things together. Okay, I need some crunchy stuff. Right? I need crunch. I have a whole drawer full of cool papers and crunchy stuff. Some crunchy stuff. Let's rip this in half. Yeah. Right, I can show you how I put my one together that I followed by Carol. If you want to see. Because this You're one makes one way more Hold on. I'm going to make you big. Okay. Hold on. So this is the front. It'll have two more pockets on it. I have Slide down the rail a little bit. Yeah, I got to fix my thing. I don't know why it's doing that. So let me grab two envelopes and show you. So it's going to have one here on this side. Like this. And then it'll have one here on this side. Like this. Okay, so that'll be the front. It'll flip this way. This way, then these close, and then it opens. So I'm going to take these off just to show you how I put it together. So this is one envelope, the brown one, the front. Then you open it, and you attach one envelope to the inside of that. That's envelope number two. Then you attach your next envelope, which is envelope number three, and these all fold out. So then you go fold, 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 and now you're at the back. This is the back cover, and it'll have the same thing, two envelopes. And then... So it's got the, so then you flip this way and it's got the pocket here. I cut mine, but it'll be glued back shut. I cut it for a reason so I can get paper in there. So then I added an, she had it end right here with this piece in this pocket. I added another one so that on the back, it also folds out like we did on the other one. She didn't make space to add one on the back. So I just added one on the back. You know how our other one, we went off of the little tabs that were hanging? Yeah. And yeah, just she like didn't the, have that. Bottom. She didn't have that available. So that's how I did that one. But I have the other one too. So I'm going to be using them both. But yeah. So this one's just put together a little different. She yeah, actually put her, envelopes inside envelopes. She put her envelopes together backwards. She put the flat end here. So when she was working on her first fold, she got herself so confused because it wouldn't fit. Because she was putting her envelopes in this side first instead of instead of this side. So that that's how hers kind of went. So yeah. So this will be the front of mine right here. This way. So here's you gonna mine? add a little one. Huh? Are you gonna add a little one? Or no? A little, a little one what? You know how they were putting little like that's got a little one on the yeah, front. Yeah. Like this one will be here and this one will be here. I have two oh. little ones. Yeah. I have two little ones on the front of mine. Mm -hmm. And the the top little one is real. This is real sturdy. Yeah. It's like real heavy. It's heavy cardstock. And so it'll sandwich them. But here's mine. So this flips this way. And I can use this pocket if I want to. Right. And this flips open. And this is completely closed. It's an envelope. But I just went ahead and closed it completely off. Oh, okay. I'm leaving and this. I'm going to do something here. Then here's where my, I'll sew this in. And then this will flip out. And here's another pocket. And then you're to the back and this will flip open. And this, so those flip differently. And then you go this way and here's another signature. Wow, wow, aren't we just oh, a little overachiever there? All right, can you look at this one a second, Deb? Because it's somehow I feel really like something different right on mine. Right All right, so here's my first one. Here's my first one. So I've got my envelope going this way. I don't like that. And then my envelope, <laughs> then this one goes this way. But then I have a pocket right here. Don't you have a pocket on your? Did you? Oh, I one? might have, but. Um... My pocket was going to be on the inside because I did do it was here. Because see, here's my front. Dot. Okay. Dot. I closed it. 
Oh, so I have the pocket okay. here, and then it flips this way, then opens, opens. I close, close a bunch close, of my clothes, and then the I back, actually... and then here's where that added one is that we didn't have on the C with the little flappy. So it goes like this. I actually ended up closing all of my pockets except for one. Really? Yeah, because I'm gonna put. I'm gonna put. Um, I think I'm gonna collage on top of these papers. Yeah. So my little ones on the front, those pockets are usable. The two, the front and the back. This is the front. And then I've got one pocket back here. This this one that'll flip open. This pocket. Okay, right. I remember that one. And now uh, the rest of them, I went ahead and closed off. Wow. So, I like the divot thingy for your pocket, like right. like some hole. I think she used your envelope hole. punch board. No, I used nope. my one inch, and then I rounded off the corners. Oh, okay. Well, like that this. almost looks like the envelope punch board when you punch it. Very you know, good. Like, yeah, I like that. Go about halfway with your punch ish. Then you just I'll take your scissors it. and you come in here and you just round off that, round off that. See? Okay. Oh, Very that's nice. pretty. Someone needs yeah, to get some get rid of that. I'm telling you, I'm going to punch somebody in the face. It's rid of that hard edge. Serious. Um, so for your issue with your round envelope, Michelle, I'm going to tell you the little trick right now because, you know, that's why we all have clues. So I took my envelope and I cut it open. It's going to be gl glued back shut anyway. I just took a sliver off each side. So when you're working with a window uh -huh. and you need something with the window for the front... I cut the envelope open so that now I have the window. And what I do is I take my piece of paper. Say this is a white piece of paper. I put it on here and I walk over to my window and I trace it. Voila. Or if you don't want to trace it, you can finagle with the cut. It's like if this is closed, I can't go to my window. But if it's like this, I can go to my window and put my paper over it. And then I'll see the window behind it. So I can, see. I liked your idea of the mini ones. The mini CD cases look really, really cute. I do not. I just can't. I don't. You can. You can do it. I don't know what to do with it. I've embossed it. It looks pretty. It's tea dyed. It's. I've done all. Well, now start things. layering up around the circle. You don't like it. Start layering up like you're doing a collage around the circle. Like I said, you don't have to have the whole circle showing. Get yeah, true. And I've done it to where, like, I've even squared it off, and I've still not liked it. I just, I don't you know. You go, big mama. I don't know what it is. You're, you're lost, Diana. It's actually, it's, oh, I think people are making themselves lost. It's actually, if you just mark a front and a back, it's, it's, it's not as complicated. These people get complicate themselves because they'll be like it goes like this and then they turn it around and then they're like wait what um if you go to uh michelle your crafting source right there that's where we did them last night i think you came in night. like right at the end diane yeah on michelle oh. 2l's channel it's just a bunch of envelopes cut open and laid on top of each other yeah that's it and then, just then it just kind of works like an accordion. Then it starts opening the other way. And then I have one that actually flips this way. But it's a flippy floppy thingy. Yep, it's a flippy floppy for sure. Don't worry, I didn't make mine like that either, Diane. I um floppy mess shoving envelopes and in, into other envelopes, and I have no idea what I made. Right. Well, nope. you made an envelope flippy floppy thing. So now I'm going to take this right over my window. This piece of paper. And I'm going to draw my window so I can see through it. That's why I opened this envelope. So I can take it right to my window and then see what I need to, where I need to cut. I shall return. She's going to go draw on the window. Yep, I'm going to go draw on the window. Okay, you do that. Hey, it works like a champ. See, crafts are fun. So, draw on windows. Mm -hmm. 
They're frustrating sometimes, but they're fun. They're very fun. Um, two L's. I tried out my new uh, Prima tape today. I, I coffee dyed fil uh, coffee filters. I have no idea with those. And so what's... I'm going to interrupt for a second. So what's nice when you trace this over the window, you know how there's a little ledge? If you're using a lead pencil, it just stays right in that little ledge while you're tracing and voila, you have it drawn on your paper. And then you can cut it out. One, two, three. Easy peasy. Easy peasy. Easy peasy. Lemon squeezy. Where's my good purple knife? I shall need that now. There it is. Big trust. Okay, I'm putting my trash in right there. Hold on. I'm down in my paper. Okay. I don't come back soon. <laughs> Look! You're never going to believe what I just found down here. What'd you find? Gold? Money? Big envelopes. Big envelopes oh my goodness Too funny i was gonna say you have sales all the time and sell envelopes how do you not have any envelopes <laughs> exactly uh, i was thinking that last night but i wasn't I gonna have, say that oh no. my gosh i have them and i have you guys want to see my envelope box? i have a huge envelope box like huge and uh yeah uh-huh i didn't have any large ones Ooh, what if I use some flyleaf paper? That's always fun. I love using flyleaf paper because it's always different. <laughs> always, always different. Nope, that's not going to work. Too fat. So I'm really sad because it's like 50 degrees outside and Shell is out there um, taking advantage of the 50 degrees and taking down all the Christmas decorations. So it makes me a little sad. Just tells me that Christmas is over. It is over. At least she's one that takes them down. Well, we could leave it up till, you know, at least January 8th. But, Why January know. 8th? Why is that a Why, that's, why is that that's, that's Little Christmas, I think. January 8th is Little Christmas? Mm-hmm. What is Little Christmas? Christmas? Don't ask me for the definition right now of what it is. I'm just telling you what it is. <laughs> little Christmas. Yeah. Spooky. Never heard of it. Somebody consult consult the Oracle. The Google. Someone consult the Google and find out. I'm using my phone. I can't. Oh wait a minute. I can I can consult on my iPad. It's little Christmas. I don't think watercolor paper would be good in here. That's too thick. Some onion skin. So addicted to that. Debbie, are you really looking it up? I will. I'm not yet. I'm trying to figure out what size jute to put in my little eyelets. I'll look it up real quick. And that one's coming out. Technical difficulties here. Huh. Let's see. What else? What is this? This is a bag full of bags. All right. Mm -hmm. 
Echo Bag. There we go. All right, so it's it has to do with, you know, Christians or Catholics. It says the feast in Western Christianity, the feast commemorates princip principally, but not solely, the visit of the Magi to the Christ child and thus Jesus Christ's physical manifestation to the Gentile. It's also called, in, it is sometimes called Three Kings Day and some tradition some traditions celebrated as little christmas i remember i've heard of three kings day that i have heard of it's the visit of the three kings to jesus former date of christmas really oh, okay. it's january 6th i'm sorry i believe it's january 6th i know it's right around there That's the former date of Christmas. Well, it says January 6th, Arme Armenia. Oh, that's Armenia. That's not it. That's not the one I'm looking for. I know it's the 6th or the 8th. Yeah, it is. It's the 6th. Hmm. Never knew that. See? Not only crafting, but educational, too. Glad we could assist. Well, that took way too long. Okay. I, I don't know. I don't I feel like I should set this aside. I don't even know what else to do. I don't have anything out. I should work on my I should work on my other thing in Maduder. What other thing in Maduber? My 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 what's it called, Michelle? Your Red. challenge. My yeah, but look. did you see Lori B's comment? People are asking what it is Lori says. It's when you regret all things. <laughs> what? <laughs> oh, boy. It's oh, your, your, it's your, uh, what is this called? What did we call it that night? Oh, my goodness. What red? was that called, Laurel? What? It's a red tag thing. Oh, the oh yeah. red pack. Rat, rat pack. pack. That's it. I'm doing a rat pack book because Deb is always so precise and everything. So I want her to do something not precise. So look, so I that's challenged me. her. You want to see the tabby thingies I made? I haven't even thought of that one yet. Crappy stuff. I'm still working on that. Ooh, those are pretty. Let me see. Oh, those are pretty. You and she talk. had to use Tracy Fox's, uh, what was it, fabric swatch? Fabric swatches. And I got the signatures done the other night. So there's five oh, signatures. Of course she did. Oh. Course she they're, did. All, they're all rippity. You pull it down just as that. Look, she did not round every corner. That was a rule. I didn't round. I only rounded one. The only corners I rounded were on the these first page of the signature because I had to because they were set up that way. And it's all lots of <laughs> lots of papers. And see, I put little tabbers on them. This little this is leather. It's blue leather. Wow. Nice. And I sewed around them. See? Oh, that is blue leather. It's blue leather. It was part of that leather pack that I got. It was a leather sample pack. I did that. The pack you got to make your chaps? Yeah, the pack I got for... Why did I buy that? I bought it for the... <laughs> it was a joke. No, I... Yeah, I did. I made chaps. That's what I did. That is true. That's no joke. Seriously, I did. Diane said one Christmas enough with my... <laughs> it's enough with my family. <laughs> I hear you. <laughs> and so this is going to go like this. Uh -huh. And this is going to go like this. No. This is going to go like this. No, we changed our mind. Like that. And that's going to go there. That is so awesome. And she's and this is going to go here on, like, this is the cover. Yes. She has to attach it. It's like a spineless book. 
There you go. Like that. And well, then the, spine, Larson. the spine and then Hi, Amanda. the back. And then she cuts that. She glues it to the embroidery fabric. Right, and then you trim it out with just a little bit, quarter of an inch or so uh -huh. around the edge. And then I'm going to line this. Are you going to? Yeah, I'm going to line it. Cool. But because you are, you got to be really careful with this as I was kind of learning as I was playing. You almost have to do these first or get them far enough along that you have a really, really good indication of how, like typically I do a cover first. I usually do a cover first and just sort of stop when it starts to get gator mouth. But in this case, mm -hmm. I'm going to get pretty far on the signatures and then do the cover. Which is totally backwards for Kim. Best backwards. I like it. So it's taking, yeah, it's like my brain's, I got to think differently. Oh, jeez, I keep hitting that wrong button. Yeah, that looks awesome, Deb. It's going to be Loving really cool. it. So I think I will work on this for a little bit. I'll work on the signatures, but I don't know what else I'm going to do. I haven't gotten... As Laurel would say, I haven't touched it enough. Right? Okay. So I need to get out a bunch of Tracy's digis around me right now because I really need to touch them. <laughs> so my brain starts. You know what I need to do? I think I'm going to put some. I think I'm going to put some like that real fabric scraps in here. Yeah, she's supposed to use scraps. And Deb is such a new crafter, she usually doesn't have scraps. So that made it a challenge. I do need to reinforce. Oh, and I put some clusters in there too. Nice. That's from the spine of the same book I'm using. Nice. Sweet. Oh, that looks pretty. And I sewed, put some hand sewing on there. Upholstery fabric supply, uh, supplied by Stock Your Stash. Okay. I this love is... You. Yes. Oh, that come black on, come is out. such a pretty fabric, too. This? Thank you. Gorgeousness. I believe I have a little bit left in I've my... got enough to do probably four or five journals of it. All right. I need to reinforce the... I need some... Fabric. All right. That's... No. I have flyleaf papers. That's a big one. I can't use that one. My glue is not playing nice today. I'm going to use my rusted fabric from my crafting source. Yeah, you did a good job on that. Yes, it's really pretty color. Go back in there. There. Very pretty color. All right, so let's use some flyleaf papers. Are you going to crack? Let's see. Oh, and of course I just did that wrong. That's okay. No, I didn't. No, I didn't. Oh, and I recorded um, the flip through of my masculine journal. I just have to. Oh, you did? Oh, you did? I okay. did record it. Yeah. Oh. I have to get my act together and post it. Oh, you haven't posted it. I thought no, you meant. I recorded oh, I was it. Say, I didn't see it this morning. I had to watch that first thing. I have to. Um, I got to take a picture of it. I got to make the title slide that and then post it. Gorgeous. I just haven't had time. It's been kind of crazy. I was at my grandbaby's house all day yesterday. Came home, hopped on here. Woke up this morning, printed out all of my 
paperwork for my oh, last you. will and testament and made met my son at the bank so he could we could get stuff notarized. Michelle Scott got all your crafting supplies, right? Yes, it's it's no. <laughs> I I divvied all of my crafting supplies to um be equally divided by my my craft squad on tour team. Nice job. <laughs> I get the rusting powder. <laughs> oh geez. Okay, this is gonna crack, so I need to reinforce it and masking tape I'm gonna need to matches back. perfectly. I love how this has the print of the book. It's like called the offset. Right, so this is what's Something like that. Need some compendium. Is this one? Did I write on it? Of course not. There, matches perfectly. This one. This has got to be two. Oh, great! I got windows open on my car. I'll be right back. Uh -oh, is it raining? Did you say she have windows? I'm coming, Joe. Yes, it's raining. I'll be right back in a minute. I'm just going to... Okay. Got to go close the windows. Right, is that too big, though? But she parked in the garage now. Me, too. We'll have to ask her about that when she came in. I thought she did park in the garage now. Maybe Cam's car. Nope, Cam's not car's not in there. Cam doesn't like to drive. It's a no-go. Okay, these ladies hanging out, you go hang out over there. Yeah, this is cracking. Big time. So this will be my, what is it? Rack pack, rat pack. Why can't I remember that? Rat, rat pack. pack. Just my rat of old Blue Eyes and Dean and all them and Sammy. My rat pack journal will be the first completed journal of 2023. Ah, very, very, very cool. So there ain't no way I'm going to. Who knows it. when mine will be? Probably about May. <laughs> so I don't know. Because I put them away. Because I get angry and I'm like, yep, you're going in timeout. No, see, I can't. Nope. Yep, they go in timeout. You do that. They go in time out and i'm like you gotta go gotta you finish them gotta go gotta finish them i need i need a mix i usually have a, a mixed media project kind of going on the side and i don't right now so you're just gonna have to help me figure out what to make uh is this another issued challenge sure Think, you know, like the violin or the encaustic boards or, you know, I'd or, do another violin if I could find a cheap one. What about those things you showed us the other night? What things? Knock, knock, knock. Um, yeah. So those I'm setting aside for a, that's my pulling my stash for a particularly themed journal. Oh, oh yeah, that's right. Yeah. Never mind. Can't do that one. No, not yet anyway. I won't use all of them, though. No. What about, let's see. Then a tiles. Use your caustics. Um, what's something you've always wanted to work with but you've never tried? Well, I have my. Uh, that's not really a. You know what I need to do? What? I need 
to figure out a way to incorporate my loom weaving weaving really? weaving with metals i would be totally happy uh fascinated by that hi happy ray i, I was gonna say happy hi happy ray i was reading happy ray and saying happy at the same time hi happy ray welcome hope you had a very a very merry christmas there reinforced not straight oh but i'm not supposed to care about such things am i no you are not it's gotta be crazy wackadoodle okay that is not going to fit on the inside without being cut so if you put it towards the outside maybe it fits better but i don't want it there i want it Let's make it this page. There, and I don't have to cut it. I don't know why I'm using this big fat bottle. Uh, Sweet, I like all the layers and the steps. Oh, we have one more piece. So dark. Love that. It picked up the watermark of the rag paper or the onion skin. All right, there's one. So you're doing a ring bound journal? No, I changed my mind now. Oh, <laughs> now I'm just doing a spineless. Okay. Which I'm going to put something on the front of here and I will bound these books together with sorry silk i'll like you know poke a hole and tie them together and then yeah. lay them in here and then i'm going to use lace to make my spine quote unquote it'll work watch cool. <laughs> you're like uh no i get it All right, are there any other pages in here that need to be reinforced? I'm reinforcing pages. Masking tape is amazing. I like using um, fabric on something like this. I think the fabric. Oh, and it will add. Yeah, and see, you can kind of see it poking through. Let me try. Yes, like. I may sew down that line too. We'll see. Because that paper is, that is cotton. That is, that paper is fabric. Nice. All right. All right, that one's done. I think I'm going to have the same. I don't think it's going to put a whole lot of pockets and doodads and things in here. I think it has a lot going on. Yeah, it doesn't need a lot of anything I else. I'll put a couple. Of Maybe like, I don't know, maybe a pocket per signature or something like that. Did you say eight? A single. Oh, a pocket. I was like, eight pockets. Wait, we just, you just said, okay. All right. Was it right there? Yes. Okay. There they are. Yeah, Happy Ray, I'm on vacation this week, and I was going, I had grandiose plans of organizing my, I have a, a room that is sort of just storage, <laughs> and it's kind of this dumping ground right now. It's amazing. Are you talking about the amazing room of Lost Crafts? I love that room. The, the room, the room of, oh my gosh, you can't walk through it. I love that room. But I need to, I need to get it. It needs to get its act together. That room is. Um, <laughs> it needs to get its act together. Yeah. Oh, that room is so much fun. It's I like when we go in that room. That's, I just open the door and throw stuff in, basically. <laughs> <laughs> she does, but it's cool. It's cool stuff. 
<laughs> it's really and I had these yeah. plans. Let's see. I have to go back to work um, Tuesday. What is today? Thursday. I still could. I could still spend a day in there, maybe. But you know what? I'm going to totally procrastinate and not do it. I know me. I'm going to wait until I literally cannot walk in there. Do and it, then I'll, and then I won't have any choice. I'll have to do something. Do it. <laughs> All right. It's bad. I think that sounds fun. I think it would be even be more fun is if you get us all on so we can watch you. <laughs> we could start well, divvying, div divvying out our uh, big moments. <laughs> when, but, but yeah, well, you want something. No, I'm throwing a bunch of stuff away. No, you are not. Yes, I am. Oh, hey, if anybody I needs a player piano paper roll, let me know. Send me a message. I can get, I think, like six boxes in a uh, priority mail. Do you have white? What? Do you have white? I don't I have a clue what's in there. Yeah, I'm sure there is. If you have some white ones, I would love some white ones. All right, I will look. Like pure white. I have, like, this color right here. I have these, like the normal... Yeah, I think that's what most of them are, but I wouldn't be surprised if there was a white one in there because that would make total sense. Well, if there is a white there's one out. in there, <laughs> I would like her name on that one. One L would like her name on that one. I have uh, I have 90 some out of them. I'm oh, pretty sure I can find it. I got a really, really good deal at an estate sale, and they've been sitting in there ever since. Hi, Laura. Song bits, Laura. She says, hi, Debbie. Hi, Laura. And there's a bunch of people that I haven't said hi to. Sorry. She's rude like that. Matt, see, Happy Ray, I think it is overwhelming. I think that's why I'm procrastinating it. Look at Laurel telling us she's getting coffee. <laughs> In the chat. Up there, I'm <laughs> just making coffee. <laughs> Good idea, Laura. Oh, it's Laura Kai. Hey, what's up, Laura? How was you new forever? What's up, girl? I know. Where have you been? Seriously. What is song bits? What's that? Are we singing now? What are we doing? You can't find it there. Are you really in Australia, uh, Messy Palette? Diana? Diane? Sorry, Diane. It's your new name. Okay, well, I like it. Tell us the story. Why did you change your name? My new name. What's the significance? Messy palette. Is that Diane? That's Diane. Diane, just send me a message. I'll, we'll figure out what it costs, and then you can decide. I'll, I'll, I'll send you the player piano roll paper free of charge, and just all you have to do is pay shipping. How's that? There you go, Diane. I don't think shipping would be that bad i think it's four pounds i know to trace ye it's four pounds i changed my name a while back she wanted something cool well i think it's pretty cool Say, I wanted a cool name. What was wrong with Laura Kai? I like Laura Kai. She said, Yes, old Australia. Why is your whole setup torn down, Crafty Ray? I hear people talk and it triggers me to a song. Oh, so if I were to say fa la, <laughs> you would start singing it. Christmas is over. You have to say something else. Okay. Um, Old ing. What did you say? Old ing. Folding? A old <laughs> ing. 
Uh, oh, old. Yeah. A, how is it spelled? That's a, it. You take over that living room. Well, I like it, Lori. You go. I can't sing worth the lick. Nope. So, nope. And do you know now if you like, I don't know, sing like a, a song, like you just start humming or whatever, you get copyright strikes on YouTube now. Really? Oh, yeah. They're making it ridiculous. It used to be so much fun. And I'm serious. It's still fun. It's still fun. But when I first got on here, you could just, oh, it was just amazing. Could do everything. And then they got sued. And, uh, the, and the Coppola's came out. And yeah. everything just went no fun. Um, you can only be yeah. sued so many times. No more fun for you. Yeah. It was yeah. like no more fun. I mean, like Abby and I used to come on. We had the friend song playing. It was just. <laughs> yeah. No. Uh -uh. Can't do it. Can't do anything. You're being monitored. Happy Ray, my entire lower level is my craft area. Well, in my office. My entire room. I just have a bed in here. I don't have my clothes. Nothing. That's all in Jaden's closet. He has a dresser. He doesn't wear hang up clothes, like dress clothes. So, oh, and my big bookboard stash is in his room too. In his closet. I only in his closet, like not so like his friends come over and like, dude, what's all that? Even though his friends kind of know what I do, he doesn't really tell. But when they walk in my room, they're like, oh, okay. My kids don't like, even know uh, my videos. I'm like, I'm kind of on YouTube. They're like, Oh my gosh. Well, not like that, but. Dude. The first thing they went, how many followers you got? <laughs> Two. <laughs> yep, that's what I say. A hundred. Uh, I, I don't know. They're like, oh, that's cool. I'm like, yep, uh huh. Yeah. Why don't you go sub? And then they're like, you lie. Uh, okay, so I got this really cute, it's a sample kit, and it's called like a mini journal, and I, it's just really, it's really pretty. Deb, you'll, you won't like it because it's pink in Paris. <laughs> yep, nope. It's no pink. pink. No pink allowed. Yep, it's pink, so you probably won't like it, but it's really, really cute, and because of the size of this... It's like, oh, it's got like some of the prettiest gold little bits and stuff. Look at this book cover. Come on. It's gold. That is, that is pretty. Oh, wait, that's upside down. That I'll give you. And it does. It looks like it's shiny and stuff. And if I went over that with my wax, oh, that'd be so pretty. Yeah. Oh, you know, if I embossed that and then touched it with my gold wax. Oh, that's an idea. But I don't have time for all that now. But the papers are just so cute and pretty. It's a mini journal. And the reason why I got this kit was for the shabbies that I did. Um, because oddly enough, I needed more pink in my pink shabby. That was a big book. That was a big book. Okay, so maybe I want this on the cover i was trying to say a little neutral but that is a really pretty picture of the eiffel tower are you doing a paris themed no no not really no just like a i have a bunch of pictures from ruby and pearl like the pictures the ladies and stuff i don't know i just eclectic 
I don't know. All kinds of things. Okay, wait a minute. Hold on. It's a huge family room. Hubby put... Oh, good hubby. I have two rooms upstairs. Got, Laurel got lost on the way to the coffee machine. That or her curing takes forever. I'm right here and it's not a curing. <laughs> <laughs> and to answer your other question, I was not in the garage because the attic's above my garage. And as I said, Shell was putting Christmas decorations away. So oh, we couldn't figure out why you were. Okay, that makes right? sense. You have a Paris journal that's been in the work for six years. Oh Isn't my goodness! Amazing, right? Like now that you're like moving your stuff and touching your stuff, when um, like you find so many things and you're like, now you have it went from like six projects you were doing to seventeen because you're like, oh, I could work with that. Oh, I could do that. Oh, I could do that. I could use that now. That's how I did when I first took the two days to reorganize my room i was like oh and i had piles like everywhere like okay yeah and then i went to the dollar tree when it was a dollar <laughs> literal dollar and yeah my dollar 25 tree anymore um oh she says thank you very much debbie the postage has been crippling and stopped me from doing u.s swaps what she's talking about you sending her some piano roll papers yes she said that was lovely oh i send stuff overseas all the time i don't have a problem with it i say that all the time ray i could sit here the last journal sent cost me 48 dollars okay so now really money well, she I got a journal that cost $48, and that's Australia, but I paid $90 for a pillow from Arizona. <laughs> you did not get that money back? Not yet. I'm yeah, sorry. That was, that was something wrong with this picture. <laughs> that $90 was in, in the United for States. For a pillow. I just, from I Arizona to Illinois, it cost $90 for an eight-pound pillow. Not even, not even across the entire U.S. No, I, yeah, I don't even get that. That made no sense when you said that. I was like, what? I, I'll never forget that. It, it's going to be forever engraved in my brain, let me tell you. <laughs> yeah. But so Diane, Diane, I'll, I, I'll put a couple in a box and find a, see if I can find a box that's like, you know, the right oh, size. More pictures. Weigh it and figure out what it would be. We'll figure it out. All right. So, you know, you I know you guys are going to yell at me in a minute, but I'm going to say it anyway. So. Hi, Abby. I'm stuck. Hi, Abs. I'm stuck. So, yes, I may have created dimensional oh, tag all through Christmas, but I don't know what to do with this thing. This is where I get stuck. Wait a minute. What? I can create, like, weird things, but the minute I have to touch paper on paper and, and make this thing, I'm stuck. I have papers printed out, but... I can't tell you what to do. What it's because no you you sucked all your crafty inspiration out with that spinning tree on a tag. <laughs> Can we just talk about that? Laurel did such an yeah. If you guys job haven't seen that, that video. Thing. You gotta go watch it. Oh, she said thank you. Wow, let me know. Okay, I'm gonna, I'm gonna write yeah. myself a note I'm, here. I'm yeah. stuck. Like I literally don't. I want to just lay everything flat, which is not me. I don't craft flat, obviously, but I got one piece of paper on and that's still not going to be right. So then it's like, okay, what do I do? What do I do now? What do I do with You're all the paper? Literally. Paper? Yeah. Don't, literally. don't think of it holistically. Ah. Look at the individual piece, like panels. Each okay. panel has a palette. Yeah, but I don't want to just lay a piece of paper, lay a piece of paper, lay a That's piece of paper. That's what I did. did? Yeah, I'm stuck, Laura. Tina did hers really cool last night when she put that, like, tree digi over both. Yeah, I like I that did. idea. I, that was a cool idea. Yep. I, I kind of have an idea in my head, but, of course, it then starts getting complicated, and then 
you know what happens from there. So uh, Laura oh. is Laura Kai, just so you know. I know. I know she changed her name. I've seen oh, that's right. You were in the kitchen making coffee, listening. No, I mean, I've seen her before, so I already knew she changed like, her she name. She already was a step ahead of us. I right. got that. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. I haven't seen Laura in a long time. I love this map. I feel really like it was a long time. And we live, what was it, Laura? We live like three miles from each other? Make your gusset with the spine for pop-up stuff. Right. Well, I'm going to try not to do pop up stuff. I'm going to try and do flips and folds, but I, or else it'll never close. Then we'll really have a problem. So we can't have that. But I am going to. What's up, Abs? How you doing? Here. I was just telling everybody. I was. How's the weather? You this morning. We were, yeah, we were just talking about you, um, Abby. About to do a boost. You just did. Your yeah. ears burning, right? Right. She knows that we were talking about her. <laughs> her journals. They are sold. They're beautiful. Of course they, they are. They were made out of post. They were made out of postcards. Postcards. Yeah, postcards. Yeah. Beautiful. Very, very cool. All her stuff is beautiful. I, I keep track of her on, on Instagram. Yeah, so your ears were burning. <laughs> That's what I thought. Hey, we were talking about you. We totally were. You know what's weird is Do I have when I pop in a chat, it's right after people are talking about purple. It's like something calls me somewhere and voila, they're talking about purple. I'm like, <laughs> what's up with that? <laughs> and Abby, we were just talking about since I'm celebrating seven years on YouTube because Itty's in here somewhere. She was. Oh, you got a deal, Laura. Friends for so long. We've all been friends for so long. Is that me? I'm the newcomer. That makes a brown girl boy. She is crazy. She is crazy. This one started, so... Laura's going to help me clean my, my room of shame. And I'm going to help her organize her stuff. I think that would be a great idea. That's actually a really good idea. I really want to watch you do it, Deb. Seriously. <laughs> Nobody Because half the stuff that you're throwing away, I'm going to be like, uh, no, no, no. It's a really cool room, you guys. Like, it's cool. I will. It um, took her months before... <laughs> Like when we first met her, she's real t timid and shy. And then it took a month for us to show us this room. Well, because I keep the door shut, that's how bad it is. I know. I've had songs written about me, and you sang to me. Yes, I know. I've been called a DJ, a cobbler. It has been a crazy seven years. <laughs> yes, it has. Crazy seven years. And only a few people have said bad things about you. Oh, yeah. Mm-hmm. <laughs> I'm sure it's just a few. <laughs> oh, uh, the sorry. The list is long, I bet. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> All those naysayers. <laughs> Aw, Abby's blushing. We made her blush. Yep. Well, they were pretty freaking cool, so. Yeah, they were. I know totally, I am. Totally, totally. I, cool. I even watched all three videos. I am a really bad, I should make that a New Year's resolution, except I don't believe in New Year's resolutions, but I watch videos and then I just go on my merry way and I don't comment. I you really, need to comment. It's so bad. So bad. And it's just because I think what happens is I get towards the end of a video and I get distracted. And then I'll get up and do something and just forget to come back and do it. I don't do it. I'm not intentionally rude. I'm just absolutely rude. Okay, comment. So yeah, we need to do a better job of that. Oh my gosh, how do I erase that? 
I'm removing what? that comment, Abby. <laughs> We're removing it. Michelle loves Abby. I'm saying that loud. No, no. no. Table scatter? Yes. Sequence. No. Table scatter, you know? No. The I... Stuff that pops out of envelopes and stuff like that. She no. loves that. Boxes. Wait a minute. The what? Table scatter. You know, no, I'm not even going to explain it. No. Uh, Abby, explain to me what table it. scatter is. I just told you, Deb, it's like, what? It's shaped sequence that you put inside envelopes and stuff, you know, like you making shaker cards and stuff. Oh my gosh, I can't stand that stuff. She lo Michelle loves that stuff. No, she I do not. not. I know not. better. I would no, I know better. No way. Mm -mm. My sister-in-law buys that stuff for every holiday. And oh, when she has it for over, shame. she puts it on her table. And I'm like, why? Why are you doing this? Yep, for shame. Nope. Mm-mm. I mean, it's cute when she does it, but I don't want that stuff. No way. Uh -uh. It's awful. Let me tell you how bad it is on a vacuum cleaner. Really <laughs> bad. Yeah, that is a good way to it's ruin really your vacuum bad cleaner. On a vacuum cleaner. All right, you stay right there. Yeah, that's what I need to do, Laura, is just say, hi, great video. Thanks, bye. You know, just, I always feel like whatever I'm getting ready to say sounds dumb. I, I swear I say a lot of the same things because I'm not, uh, I told you I'm not a good writer or anything. So, um, yeah. So I everything I say probably sounds dumb. X-O-M. Oh, I put X-O-X-O-Me. <laughs> With two purple hearts. XOM. This is my signature. After I've said something. Something. Sprinkled. Oh gosh, is she on. still talking? <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, Amy, that's hilarious. <laughs> hmm. <laughs> nope, didn't even notice what it said to you. I was picking it up. I was I didn't even look in the box. I was like, oh my, look at my floor. Look at my floor. Look at my floor. <laughs> Yeah. Mm -hmm. And I believe we were on a live. Oh bye. This is one of my birthday parties on a live. Yep. <laughs> Table scatter. Do you remember that, Laura? We used a craft for like 12 hours. It's when mm -hmm. you made the tag wall hanging. Right. The tag remember wall. Remember when Abby made the right. 12 hour tag? Oh my gosh. I don't think she's lived that down. One tag in 12 hours? One tag in 12 hours. Oh, geez. <laughs> and Laurel made one so big, it's now wall hanging. Right. It was a tag and it turned it was a tag. wall hanging. <laughs> but she just kept going, shoop. Yeah. Yep. I just don't know how to stop. Oh, bye, Christina. Bye, Christina. Have fun, have fun filming, Abby. Bye, bye Abby. Christina. Bye, Abs. Love you. <coughs> She's going to be announcing your love for table scatter. <laughs> Do not. <laughs> she said, shut it. <laughs> You don't have to worry about me sending any because there is none in my house. <laughs> you will not find table scatter in my room, my disgusting uh -huh. room. See, but oh my goodness, yes. I oh gosh. I think it was something like green too. It wasn't even like pink. It's like a green color. Whatever, brain surgery, blah, blah, blah. <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> oh, jeez. <laughs> All right, where's brain my surgery? There we go. This is what I need. One of these. Oh, these are pretty, pretty. 
Gonna have to get the brick out. <laughs> The brick to hold it down. Yeah, I gotta get the brick out. It's almost got bad brain surgery. Oh my gosh. Oh. None below. I think that's gonna have one. Okay, so I think I'll use the the front for the front and the back for the back. That makes sense. Paris team. <laughs> Have you guys got Wow, where did that come from? Like puberty. Have you guys <laughs> got did you hear that? Jeez. What is it that you're trying to say? <laughs> yeah. Stand now. <laughs> you can do it. <laughs> With my new voice. Have you guys? <laughs> um okay. crap. Um oh have you guys got addicted to ripping paper with your roller? Yes, that's why my ruler is sitting here. Seriously, like I can't have it like off my here. desk. Well, my ruler is always on my desk anyway. Well, it would be different if I had my nice paper cutter rag. But now okay. I'm totally addicted to using a ruler. Anyone else? No. I still like my paper cutter. Oh, <clears throat> man. I love it. I love leaving like white. I don't like inking all the way now. Like, where have I gone? Because I used to be like a really heavy inker. I have a video on it. I have three colors that I would use and just. Oh, I haven't changed my mind on that. Me either. Well, I don't use multiple colors. I usually just stick with one just from a just from a time perspective. <laughs> oh, really? Boy, you go get him, girl. Yeah. Someone wants to, you know what? It's that time of day. <laughs> you better go get him one. No, he's got to go potty. She has the prettiest pups. Freak time. She does. Oh, man, are they pretty. They're my babies. They're gorgeous. Ooh, so that actually won't even work. Way to go, Michelle, in measuring that. Maybe we'll just use it as a little tuck piece. All right, where's the dark one for this? Okay, I don't like that. That I don't like this. This showing. I don't like that. But oh. I don't know. Ooh, ooh. Yeah, I'm in some the fabric. Hold on. Just putting some plain fabric down and just like ripping it. That's what I'm going to do. Hold on. Which fabric? Oh my goodness. Make up your mind. Oh. This is probably my biggest addiction right here. Diane, I love glitter too. It's probably infused into everything in my room from using it for the Christmas stuff. But I, 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 I do love glitter on certain things. So I, I don't have a problem with glitter. Do you have that shirt, Morel? What? Do you have the yeah. shirt? Yes, I do. I bet you do. I bleed glitter. Or the one that says, I, I sweat oh. glitter. Yeah, something like that. I sweat glitter. Yeah, no. I crap so hard, I sweat glitter. Yeah. Never been a huge fan of glitter, mostly because I don't like cleaning it up. That's what it is, Deb. Yeah, I don't mind the, you know, the pretty part of it. When you're done making whatever it is you've done with it, it's pretty. But I don't want to have to clean it up. 
I think we would use this pretty. Round fabric. Maybe. I don't know. Hold on. Meanwhile, I've got. Uh, yes, I like that. Who does this? Who does this the fabric? I just can't stand when people hunk fabric out. What? Oh, what do you mean? Hunk it out. Like I got when I go and like find fabrics and stuff or stock your stash and I'm like, oh, I can only sell you a piece because somebody decided to take a big hunk out oh, of it. right out of the bed. Right. Yeah, I don't like when they hunk it out. Like when I take out a piece, I'm gonna take out enough for me to work with, to use like for my embellishments, things like that. I don't hunk it. I don't hunk it out. Okay, everybody done going potty? I don't even know if this is hair. This is a beautiful fabric. I don't think it will. Oh, yeah, it does. Sounds like it's tearing. Yeah, buddy. Sweet. That means it's going to shred. Oh, we like shredding. And we like messy ends and all oh yeah oh that's gonna be pretty i love that and it matches that eiffel tower perfectly yeah, where did those other ones come in from? i'm confused is there anyone that's like a bark cloth expert in chat or by chance is Laurel or Debbie a bark cloth? I know nope. a little bit about it. That's about it. I sort of know what it is. That's about it. You just know what it is. I got a bundle and it's going in stack your stash. And I think that it is. I just have studied it and studied it so much. I really think that it is. Because I've has never to do with a specific texture, I know that. Yeah. Yeah. I know this piece is not. I just put it in the bundle, but isn't there a way to tell? I feel like I there is, but I don't know what it is. Please. See how the lump oh wait. Make yourself big. Let me go big. Go big or go home. Go big. Do you see it? Yeah. And they're cut and there's the back and oh, see yeah. it has that yep back to it i think it's all bird cloth and there's another one and these all like are the same and they're more expensive right like right well, yeah. Yeah. it's yeah. just because they're hard to find yeah, they're very, it's very hard to find. And they always have like wacky designs and stuff like this. I'm thinking like, even if it is bark cloth, I honestly don't think like this is. Oh like my goodness, vintage. Diane. That's terrible. I don't think it's a vintage one. I think it's more like, you know, the new production of it. Because that doesn't look like they're supposed to look like old drapes and stuff this one is definitely because for one it's ugly well it's not ugly but you know what i mean it's just whoa a, a off print like retro yeah so this one and this back is the same as these backs i just I'm so stumped if they are or not. And I hate to 
sell them when I don't know what they are. But they feel to me, this is bark cloth. And I have a real piece and I've compared like feeling it. I don't know. And they feel the same? And they feel the same. Well, I don't know. Garage door. Yep. <laughs> Garage door. Leave, it, leave it to Michelle. <laughs> oh, I geez. know all the noises of Florel's house. In the summer, we got Motorcycle Man. Oh, jeez. I'm surprised I don't hear any of the Harleys out today. It's so nice. I shouldn't have said that though. Now that I yeah, now that. you've said that, now they're all going to come out, right? Right. It's going to be like. Arr. Hello, oh, ladies. Geez. Just got home from the hair shop. Well, hello, Grace. Hi, Sherilyn. How are you? Hi, Hi Sherilyn. It says tales from Grace, so it must be something new I don't know about. But oh, girl, she's been in that. Forever. Rosemary. Lori B says Rosemary is big on bark cloth. Mm -hmm. mm hmm Okay, so. We have a name called Tales from Grace, but it's Sherilyn. <laughs> Why? Sherilyn. Hey, Sherilyn. Don't get what up, you. my homie? Okay. I just moved us all back. Sorry. Good. Clouds are good. How's your Christmas? Okay. And also, the way that I know that it possibly could be is it's all over the front of me right now because it 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 shreds it's a good shredding fabric and yeah it's literally on me hmm. yeah i don't know okay so i'm putting this down because i think this will be very very pretty I'm gonna let it hang over the sides a little. No, I can't let it hang over the sides because of the lace that's coming up. I did get a new toy for my computer because Cam had got me a speaker for my computer. Well, the whole the computer I have solely wants to be Bluetooth. It has no auxiliary co cords or anything in it to hook anything up. No auxiliary mm -hmm. cords and stuff. So, like everything you get. Um, that doesn't work off of USB has to be Bluetooth, like my speakers or my headphones. So she ordered me a different speaker and it came while I was outside moving my car. Nice. Will it work? So I have, you know why I have to show it to you, right? Hey, Lisa J, because it's purple. Well, Lisa, it's just a tiny little thing, but it's very powerful. And it'll sit right under my keyboard. And it lights up all in purple and stuff. And it's purple. It's purple. And it's going to sit right here because my speaker on my computer is just not loud enough. Do you know that uh, my shower head is Bluetooth? Really? Yep. That's kind of cool. Yep. It's a rain shower head, and in the middle yeah. of it is a speaker, and that's how you hear Jaden's music while he's showering. Wow. Yes. He loves the thing. He's in there for like a half hour. I'm like, oh, okay. What, enough about him and what is it with that, right? So I asked Cam, Cam, I seriously want to know why it takes you over an hour in the shower. Yeah. And she's like, I rush. I, I by the time I'm, I'm like, no, there's no such thing. <laughs> it's not. I can it hear over. him in there just singing and jamming, and I'm like, really, really, like I don't need music to shower. I'm in. I'm out. That's right? it. Let's go. I got things to do. I tried it one day and I couldn't really hear my phone, so I'm like, okay, I really don't need music in here. I just need to take a shower. Brought your down. Um. And if he doesn't use that one, then he has another one. It's it is enormous. It's like a Bluetooth speaker that uh, I don't know. It's just big that he carries around for his shower. Okay, this blue on my finger. All right, those can go away now. No way, just 
just go away for a minute. Right, store up. Right, up, down, up, down. Make a decision. All right, so now it's ripping the wrong way. Come on. Okay, where I need that. Hi, Joe Kane. Blanket hello to you. What are we working on? Um, did Beth get out, back out your flip flop? Yeah. Okay. Debbie and Laurel are working on flip flop journals. Continuation from 2L show last night. And I'm working on a spineless book. Mm -hmm. Okay, so I need to make enough room. You know what? I should probably tear it first. That would be the idea. All right. Oh, let's go right there. That is definitely not the direction of the fabric. Would be. I am sweating from doing that. <laughs> sweating. All right. Oh, I have to put glue on my finger. Ooh. What? I have to put glue on my finger because my corners didn't go down. You know how you have to spread this out or it'll have those marks? Yeah. Mm hmm. So I have to do the corners because I've heard. Do you have a silicone spatula? Oh, yes, I do. Yeah. Why, yes, I do. We all have one of those. Yes, yeah. I do from mm -hmm. my crafting source. My crafting source. Get that glue off my finger. Oh, Debbie Kip, you go, girl. <laughs> oh, that is so much better. Uh, Carolyn wants to know what you mean by a spineless book. Um, a book well, without a spine. Uh, <laughs> sorry, couldn't resist. I was going to put a sarcasm banner up. Um, <laughs> uh, the night, so many variations. Yes, there is a lot of them, Jill. Because I didn't make mine anything like theirs. Nope. Um, Mine's different too. Yeah. I I couldn't figure it out. I wasn't, I'm not smart enough. Um, so I'm going to have this and this. These are my two signatures. I'm going to go ahead and uh, poke my holes in here. And I'm just going to run sorry silk through them. Put them between the boards like this. So they're actually going to have the sari silk. And uh, I'm going to put lace over the edges and then tie a bow. And it will be spineless and it will expand. It will do whatever you need it to do. Um, you can make it larger or smaller. Um, Wait a minute, you're going to put lace where? Right here on the... Oh, strips. Two strips. But you're not sewing the signatures into the lace? No. Uh -uh. They just get... Uh, you just tie them around or underneath them or somehow. I guess I will tie them... Let's see... I will probably tie them around the lace strips. That way the book will stay. In. I would say that's what I've seen done is that yeah. 
<coughs> so you'll have like um and you could just use like a piece of this plain fabric just to make a hinge go to the fabric hinge and then you can tie your two bows you can position this when you sew in your sari silk to make a bow here and make a bow here and it will actually kind of hide masquerade that lace right here if you want to it's obviously going to stick on top of your book but and on the back doesn't really matter um i i kind of did it if you saw my video the shabbies the pink one look at the pink big massive one um kind of has that theory of the sorry silk and putting them all in I don't know. Did you understand that? Yeah. <laughs> I tried. I tried. Believe it or not. Um, but I am going to cut this down here because this is the side that the lace is going to go on. And I don't really want it like hunkered down or look weird. So I want this uh, closer to the book board than the outside. The outside can hang all at once because this will be covered. And then it'll just open like a normal book cross your fingers and which way does this fabric go it goes this way yeah this way so i have to cut off this side or cut it down i still want some fraying but not as much as the bottom and the front. So if I can take over here. So Bye Ray. Bye Ray. Have a good day. Bye Ray. I made a rhyme. And that's how we get it to fray. We love these from the dollar twenty-five tree, right? Hey, when I bought mine, they were a dollar, so I can still do. <laughs> and I stocked up, so I'm good to go. The other day, I was there. Something was three bucks. Well, you were at a dollar tree plus or something because I know I watched you the whole video on time it. Didn't change yet, though. Really? No. That shouldn't have been because I know they're talking about some stores will have like, and it was supposed to be like Dollar Tree Plus, and some stores would have stuff in it was that was more than you know a dollar twenty five. But you really oh, got to pay for all. I thought they were be all careful. Have. Like their plastic um, ornaments they had for Christmas that you could decorate uh -huh. are dollar a quarter. Walmart's are ninety six cents. So why would I buy them at the dollar store? Exactly. You know. This is like Walmart's time. Oh, well, like they need more money, but to pounce because it is actually cheaper to go to Walmart now than it was than it is to go to the Dollar Tree because well, it's not a Dollar stuff. Tree anymore. For some stuff, not for everything, but for yeah, for some things. Um, I'm actually saving saving these fibers for uh, like um, decorating and tags and stuff yeah I, I save mine too i like fibers oops that's upside down i gotta stay, figure this out here and it's only gonna shred until the glue stops So that's the end of the shred. And then you glue right there. Oh, that to me gets my little silicone thingy. Totally cool. I'm trying to finish up this beacon three in one. Yeah. Why? Uh, just because I've had it for a while and I wanted to try it and see if it was the same as Fabri-Tac. It is. 
Yeah, it's exactly the same. It's exactly the same. It's just because um, they put it in a different aisle to use. It is a little more stringier. The company, will tell you, something. the company will tell you the difference between the two is that one is machine washable, the other is not. Okay. I know one's I a little more stringier than the other. Oh, this one says acid free and waterproof. This must be the washable one. Hold on. Yeah, I did a search and destroy mission one time trying to figure out what the difference between them was. No, nope. it says Fabri-Tac is washable. Okay. I knew one of, one of them was wa waterproof. But wouldn't that be washable? Or we're gonna we're gonna take our oh, journal. I mean, water. you know, is are any of us actually trying to wash anything? Right. Yeah, I'm gonna take this book and go throw it out in the rain right now and see how it holds up. Okay. The book board would be like probably destroyed before this clue. The book board would be like, um, no. See, a dollar thirty. What's up, Toys Good? Not happening. Yes, I'm not so crazy. <laughs> All right, so I have to move this to the outside because of those flaps. And I think I know which lace I'm going to use. Is in the zone. Yeah, my brain is going right now. <laughs> no, duck. Oh, I could put it together with doilies. Oh, um, stop. So that one actually needs to go a little further, but that's okay. Hold on. No, I don't want to do that. I would rather use fabric. Okay. <clears throat> of lace. Mm -mm. Okay. My phone keeps making all kinds of noises. I'm not sure why. Bunch of nonsense. All right. So I did that for nothing. Maybe I could put that on the back. I've yet to use my new stamp, too. I think I want to use my stamp <coughs> on the front. What, what stamp? What stamp is that? The Prima, the Prima one that Michelle had at her last one. That one. I want the blotch. Oh, that's really pretty. Yeah. I think it's like a scribble, right? Yeah. And I like the blotch and the... Yeah, I like it all. The splatter. So I think I just want to use this side. I don't need the butterfly. It doesn't have. But if I put it on. I'm going to try it around my Paris picture. I'm going to try that. Fabrics out of the way. little threads. It's amazing what we keep. Hopefully you guys can appreciate it. Do 
too much. Right? I keep a lot of nonsense. But it's one of those things where you're like, well, you know, if I throw no. it away, then okay, so this is going to be my back. You never know. I might need it for this or that. That's my dilemma. Yeah, but then I forget when I do need it, I forget that I've got it. Like, I don't do a good job of remembering. If I've kept too, if I have too much, let's put it this way. If I have too much, I don't do a good job of remembering what I have. So I don't have a problem throwing things away. I do not have a problem with throwing things away if I have to, if I need to. Yeah, like I'll, I'll go in the spring and Jaden's got some bag waiting. Like when he gets home from school, he's like, really? You cleaned your room? Yep. I don't know exactly what it's from. You cleaned your room. Like, yep, sure did. Sure did. Okay. Well, so I do that with my clothes closet, too. I go through it twice a year. Clumpy. Donate. Donate, donate, donate. donate. We have a free store that's really close to us and could take a lot of stuff there. She doesn't really take crafts or anything like that anymore, but she used to. I don't think she does anymore. I don't like that glue, just so you know. Which one? The three in one. I said it's a just little stringier than Fabri-Tac. Like and it's a little, I don't know, maybe it's because it's a small jar, but it's its almost thicker. And it, I don't know, coming don't out. Know oh, I've got Fabri-Tac going right now. So did I tell you about the new tips that I found that work great? Because I think I, I told you guys while we were on that night, if I can find what it. Tips? The tip of what? Fabri Tac for the sugar bell bottle, you know, because I love my sugar bell bottle. So I was using those blue ones that you can't get anymore. Mm -hmm. But every time I open my Fabri Tac, my hands are full. So I use my teeth. Well, I eventually bit a hole right in the tip of the blue one. <laughs> so, <laughs> so I went in the, because it has to be purple too. I went in the crochet aisle where the, um, crochet hooks are and they sell these like for <laughs> oh the crochet hooks. tips yeah and it's all solid at the tip but it fits on here perfectly and I can pull it off really easy with my teeth not have to oh worry about putting a hole in it bye bye for, have a good night at work have a great night bye so for any of those that can't find those other tips those things work great and they come Their in a crochet color. hook I yeah, or knitting needle covers. They're for both. Huh. Um, Very cool. Yeah. I'm like, okay. I got I'm a pack of four. I saw those suggested for something else, too. And now I can't remember what it was. Probably uh, the glossy oh, accents. Or the art, well, not the art. Well, they go on the art glitter glue, too. Or the art glitter glue. Like that one needs to have a pin in it, so it's kind of. Yeah. I know well, mine I has you nothing. Could put your pin up in the center, you could. So you could put this on here. Instead of trying to find the little pin thing, put that on there, and it'll pull your pin right out. Look, you could use it for that. Make it a little it's bit bigger. Than mine. I, I uh, just gave up on the silver tip. Laurel, forget it. Oh, yeah. It was not coming. I get, out I get mine on Amazon. I just it buy the little pack so of them on Amazon. Not coming out of there. I had soaked it. I had what? Scorching hot water. It was. Uh, you know what out. I ended up doing, Michelle? Um, I got different tips, and my tip now is you talking about the sugar bell bottle. No, no, I'm talking about, about, about the art glitter, glitter, glitter glue. glue. Yeah, I just put them in these things now because that oh. works 10 times better. And just use my art glitter glue to refill right. that yeah, little that bottle. I don't have any trouble with my tip as long Me as either. I... 
as long as I get it plugged up while I'm using it without letting it sit too long. Well, Michelle's tip that she gave for the chapstick around the bottle that I tell everybody about. And oh, I'm yeah. Sure so to tell me, tell me. Stick, yeah. So I actually do that on the tips of my pins is I just dab some chapstick on it before I slide it in. Then I don't have to worry about it getting stuck in there. That was a good idea. Yep. Yeah, especially E6000. Wow. Put some chapstick around that. Because that is really super hard to open. Yes, it is. I use these pliers. Yeah, I have the ones that have the tips on them. So. There's tips on them now? You can buy them to put these little tip, five tip. point tips on them. Yeah. yeah. I always have a reaction when I use that glue. Door up. Yeah, I don't use it very often. I got to be desperate. I mean, I got it's like I'm gluing something, and then that is the only thing that'll work. It makes my hands really, really itchy, and I'm like, oh, okay, yeah. yeah, maybe you shouldn't be using it then. Don't use and, it. Uh, I don't, I don't use it unless I absolutely have to. Glossy accent does metal like, good enough for me. Draw, draw down. Um, I think Cam just came home. That's why she was riding the horses. Oh, it's a nice day to do that. Yeah, it was. All right, I keep no, it is. I keep taking out one of these things and I keep losing it. So it needs to fall over the floor. Okay, I like that. There. In fact, my phone, I'll know if that was her. Pray. <laughs> I hardly ever look at that thing anymore, ever. Well, mine sets the notifications only for Jade. Nice when she was in school. Let's see if Cam's home. I told you what I said when he's at school. I got a message that said heading back, so I'm going to guess it's her. Oh, no, she's still driving, so that must have been Shell pulling her car in or something. What does it say when he's at school? A place filled with bozos. <laughs> it says Jay is at a place filled with bozos. Oh, geez. Yep. That's what he's got. I'm like, yep. And then, of course, it puts me there when I'm dropping him off. <laughs> They're like, what are you doing? I'm like, just dropping them off. I'm at a place filled with photos. Place filled with photos. All right, come on. Oh my now. goodness, have we really been on here two hours? Probably. Well, again, here we go. When we're just sitting crafting, I time. Know does go by that's it's inevitable it is true <laughs> it's gonna happen that is true that is true so true it's too short time does go by and i'm still working on my front piece because you know that's just me <laughs> i'll be here till christmas next year with this project <laughs> Oh, I like it. Are you making it rippy looking? Yeah, I am. That's cool. Um, let's see. Oh, that looks really cool. It's very dimensional. Well, it won't be when it's down. I know it looks like it right now, but there's it's got to be flat because I got. Don't give me more ideas because I'm looking yeah, at never it. Right, never mind. Mind. Don't I'm mount like, anything. I'm like that looks see, cool like that. See right nothing. Now. I'll see nothing. Right. Okay. Which part was the back? Okay. Is here. I always can't find my other board. Oh. I can always print out more of these because I really like this pattern. Okay. I so can't believe I'm setting the string. Okay. So let's go ah. for this one. Oh. 
what happened. Because I had it upside down. There we go. There. It'll look like that. Ooh, I like that. I love this brown fabric. Where did I get this? Love it. No. Yeah, I don't know either. Love it. What? What? Why does my phone keep vibrating? I don't know. I don't even know where mine is. Don't pay attention to it ever. If Jane's at home, I'm not even looking at it. Okay, cool. Whoops. So I'll keep it neutral. Keeping it neutral. Keeping it neutral. Keeping it neutral. And I'll sew it in with neutral colored sari silk. Those don't look the same. That's colored pink. Oh, All right. This way. Oh, this is pretty. I don't know where I got that. Come on. The man who needs has been in here with Laurel. Oh, no. Do you know that that's a real thing? I like, know. Oh, my goodness. I thought you were just like. No, I didn't all make all that word up. Real thing. Yeah, I've learned that they just live in my room, so. It's a Hawaiian thing. I yes, did not know Emily. that. Minute, what's a real thing? Menahunis. She always oh. said. The Menahunis have, the have been in here and touched my stuff. Yeah, and I'm like, okay, the Menahunis. I thought it was just like some cute little name she made up or something. No, they really exist. Yes, it's a Hawaiian thing. Sounds very similar to another word. Which is? A, a word used to describe men's private parts. Menahunis. <laughs> no, those are, oh wait, hold on, those are called I'm not going to say the word. I, I know what you're I was trying to avoid it. <laughs> right. It sounds like that. Yes. Yeah. Oh, we're going to tell me the word afterward. That's I, what I thought I you were saying at first. Say. That's why I said, um, wait a minute. What? Right? <laughs> oh, too funny. All right, so I need this to come down more. Okay, I'm going to save that one. I could go with the color, but which one do you pick? All right, I'm just going to stay with this. You have to cut it before that. I love these. Thank you for suggesting that because it came right off and now it's like clean. The silicone yep. to put on the glue, that's. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'd like that. And then I used my big one to spread it on when I had all of it done. All right, let's go right there with that. Let's see if I can get my logo. Yeah, down. I like that. I got to sew so on this. Hold on. Hold that idea. Hold that thought. All right, let's get this boards out of the way. This out of the way. It's out of the way. I need the book. Make sure they're all the way that I want them. There's nothing in here, so there's nothing directional. And that stitch is going to catch that bottom one. Because some of them won't. They're not full papers, but as long as one catches... Or you can make them right there. 
which is probably something that I should do since if you go like right here and here because of the book size. Oh, that would be cute. Oh, I'm doing that. Yeah. Made my mind up. Now I got to grab the book. be really quiet because I'm by my camera. I have to stand up for it. Alright, where's the middle? And I always lose track of where my centers are. So I'm just going to clip this one. Because I'll pick it up and think it's the other signature. And normally I would template this, but I am not today. Eyeballing it. Living on the edge. I am. Laura just went into that song. Right? <laughs> the song that we can't sing anymore. Okay, so Oops. realizing this, boy, did I cut off a lot of sorry silk. I could have done one book with two. So I might be able to do that. I'm going to do it here. You guys like my new brick background? You made it for me yesterday. Mm-hmm. That's like sweet. Okay. I covered the girl with the pocket. Yay. Oh, that looks so pretty. No more people in that bag. Love. Took one panel done. Love, love, love. Okay, that's, that's I still don't know what I'm going to do on the cover. I have to make these holes extra big because of the sari silk, and I have to use a huge needle. It's an, a big eye to get the sari silk through there. It all worked out. Okay. Big neat one. See how big that eye is? Mm-hmm. It's big. Is that for your sewing? Yeah. It's just for putting my... What you call it together? What are these things? Signatures? Yeah. Signature, that's what they Signatures, are. yeah. So I put it in one end and pull it. And usually I have to get a wrench or pliers. What are those called? Yeah, pliers. But I got it. Take it out. Do you have any of the? Did you get any of the um, rubber fingers from the Dollar Tree? You know the tips, the little pink ones they have. Uh huh. What does it do? Uh, you just grab on that little sucker, and it'll come right through. Really? Yeah. What rubber? Beads. If you use these. I dyed mine purple. They were pink. Shh. Anyway. Seriously. <laughs> Be quiet. Oh, anyway, oh, when oh, you're oh, pushing oh. a needle, I'll grab out a big one and show you. See, I usually oh. just grab these bad boys right here. When you're taking a needle and you're going through the thing, it even helps push, and then you just grab, and it pulls it right through because it's Oh, because it's grip. grabbing. Yep, yep. Okay. Yep. That makes Works sense. Works great. Then you don't got to have the players out. All right. Uh, my pliers are right here. Pretty easy. Oh, let's but, see. 
caught everything. Does that protect, does that rubber thing help you? Like when I'm working with needles, I almost yep, always protect your finger. Why I have them because I like to poke myself with them. Yeah. Okay, so that did it. I'm actually going to see if I can get two books out of the sorry silk. That's kind of crazy. We may have one page done by the time we're done here. Maybe, just maybe. <laughs> Or at least the, the first layer of the page. I'm not going to say I'm going to have the whole page done, but. For about. Going here. And this one's going here. And then I can cut this one because I don't need that whole thing. So that's going. I know that bow is extra huge. Here but... comes Laurel talking to herself, but that's okay. I've learned. To leave yourself enough sorry silk. Okay, here we go. Book number mm -hmm. two. That's going to go there. Uh oh. Get back under there. That needs to be a little closer. That's yep, go. there she goes. That's going to go there. Okay. <sighs> mm. A little more. Good, good. Yeah. Good. Good? Okay. Yeah. Okay. As long as it's good. Deep pliers. Uh, she's sweating, sweating, putting in a signature. Do you know that that is my least favorite part of this whole thing? Mm -hmm. Signatures? Sewing and signatures. Yep. yep. Agree. Do not like it. It's kind of a necessary evil. Yep. No. And in particular about mine, and which just makes it even more annoying because of my own thing. If you guys don't have it all, you can go to Walmart and get darts. Works the same. They're three for 99 cents. That reminds me. I don't know why that reminds me, but that reminds me. The old design shop is having a 70% off sale her entire shop. Uh, Ooh La La Vintage Treasures is having 50% off, I believe, until New Year's. I believe I saw that, too. I don't know um, if you guys know, in the down bar below uh, is my D stash page. Um you know, people try to sell campers and crap on there. Uh, there are sales galore up today from, is there anyone in chat? Like, sound off if you're here. They're here. They're just, <laughs> no, are they crafting with us? Um, there, I approved uh, a bunch of posts today for a ton of, Sales, sales stashes um i don't know you girls that are into those tumblers and stuff oh my goodness there's a girl who's selling her whole craft of them or i don't know what you would like they're her whole stash of her tumblers and everything hmm yes i've had it for almost five years there's three thousand people on it you ever want to post your sales for your sales on YouTube or anything like that, you're more than welcome. Um, cause we are up there right now. It's on the page. This 
this show um, just because I let everyone know that I do promote that uh, selling page. All right, so there we go. It's not coming out. It's not coming out. I should have used more sorry silk on this, but that's okay. And I don't like them like that. I want them like that. Okay, let's get my, you know, I knew that was wrong. My, I didn't know my colors first. Because I could see it right away. I was like, that is not the right color. Laura says, here. Sherilyn says, I noticed. Everyone is watching. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I like that collage, Deb. I want to keep it behind the blue. This is the back page. So I'm just playing with it a little bit still. Not there yet. Don't look oh, yet. That looks awesome. Yeah, I'm glad I'm just going around to your desk real quick. I'm going to go. Yeah, I'm going to go all the way up to here. This is over too far. I'm going to get I'm going to get this in. How are you going to take that off? Huh? Is it thicker? Oh, it's not glued down yet. That's not, I'm, not, I'm just playing right now. Oh, okay. I'm not oh, glued. How are you going to get that off the page, girl? That's what oh, I do. And then I take a picture. You lay your stuff out really neat. That's how I, I lay it all out. And then I take a picture. And then I take it apart. Wow. And then I glue. Yeah. Well, I do that on covers. I don't usually do that with something like this just because. I don't know why I don't. Um, There's Laurel. That looks like almost like Alice in Wonderland. Why Ooh, that that's cool, Laurel. This reminded me of Alice in See, Wonderland. But this is how, this is why I don't go live because this is how my brain works. I have to physically be touching her papers, and like a little idea comes at a time. Well, that looks like. Wicked Very hard cool. for me to go live because I just. But that's exactly to... what the way it happens to me. I like I didn't think of this like this. Take this collage for example. I didn't start thinking about it until I started picking up pieces and playing right. and auditioning them. I think is the word people use. Um, so yeah. That Lord, cool. hi. I will pray for you. I am very sorry to hear that. <laughs> Oh no. Sorry. Dog. Is about my okay, seven year old cousin just passed away from her aw seven. Aw. Cancer. Sucks. That's terrible. I will definitely be saying some prayers. I'm so sorry. I will. Okay, so here's the question, Laurel. Yes. Why don't you just lay down that Harlequin print first and then just rip the top paper? Nope. Because that'd be too easy? Yeah, because my brain doesn't work like that. So. Okay, just checking. I could have, but yep, nope, I didn't. Because I'm right. putting the bits back together. Right. Well, because I'm going but to it be, so, I'm going to be, that I'm way. be sewing all these too. Yeah, and it looks more splashier that way. Like the Wolverine right. just came by and went, ha! Yeah. Right. Like, I don't like it. Oh, that looks so cool. Why is that? My, it's the Harlequin print or the color yeah. of that. Yeah. Because there's so, bits of, because you know, I have to right? pull in bits of purple. So there's bits of purples in the digitals I'm using. So I want to bring it in in other ways too. Just bits and pieces of it. Well, of course. Because, you know, all Christmas I didn't play with any purple, so I, I need to play with some purple right now. <laughs> all right. I think that's going to work. You definitely will, Lori. Laura, sorry. I was reading two different names. She said pray for her, her big sister, Kate. 
Yeah, definitely. That's terrible. I I can't. I don't even try. I can't even imagine. There's no even imagining. So, you know, no. That's not going to work. All right. So, yeah, that's one here. That. All right. Go there. So I'm going to put that on. I don't like both of the signatures the same. So we're going to flip one up like this. The bow doesn't matter right now. Let's get them in. This is going to work. I'm probably going to have to get another piece because I screwed that up and I don't like it now. No, I didn't. I ripped it before I left myself enough room. So I don't, just knowing that there's two pieces glued together, it's like just start over and get a new piece, Laurel. Do it the right way. <clears throat> I need to see how much room I need to have here. And yep, I could have done it the other way. That would have made more sense, right? But no. I have to do it the difficult way. It's all good. I was just asking. Yeah, I don't know, because that's where my brain went. Makes perfect sense to me. That's going to be cute. Probably because I didn't want to waste the whole piece of paper because I want to keep using the scraps. I hate to put a whole gorgeous piece of paper hidden underneath something. So that's why I did it like this. Just because, you know, it takes uh, more time. Got ya. All right, so now I need a piece in here, and I need to make sure it's wide enough. So we need there to at least here. All right, let's try this again. Okay. Let me pick the lace. Okay. You could do anything, like use an applique, just anything to close the book. What a pretty decent size one. Pretty strong. So what's nice about this silicone mat is if you have to cut a really thin piece with your ruler because it doesn't move when you put the ruler on you can cut this really thin line and just press down and it'll still do it where on a regular table it won't because it'll just slide out i love these things man i hate when my stuff moves all right so now we need to get this piece in here and then this piece has to go here so i need at least Let's see. Let's do this. Let's move this up. Move this over. Okay. Let's put this under here. See how much we need. So two will do. And then I need this here. So this can. I need this here. So. There's my flappies. To at least here. I don't like them that are. So. Right, stop talking out loud, Pharrell. What? <laughs> I'm telling myself to stop talking out loud to everybody. Doesn't bother me. Nope. It's normal. I've crafted with her for so many years. I'm so used to hearing her talk. Actually, 
soothing to me. It's like if I don't talk out loud and talk it out, I work something up every time. Works your process out, nerd. Right? Another lace on top of that. So I'd asked in my my video where I did the voiceover, which I thought, I'm sorry, I did go back and watch because, you know, I was so tired that night. And I sat and had my own giggle to myself. <laughs> Laurel, you were hilarious in it. You're like, here I am talking some more. Don't ask me what I'm doing, but I'm right? talking because my hands are moving. I, I can't I read my hand signals. Laughing so hard at your voiceover on that. I, so I had asked people in chat, nobody answered, you know, do you like this? Do you want me to do more of these? Because to me, it was just so much easier too. You know, I just seemed much calmer and, you know, because I knew funny. I already saw what I was making, you know, so it was like, it's so funny. And you're like, yeah, I'm going to put this over here, but yeah, that's not going to happen. I'm not going to use it. Right. <laughs> I was just like, what? Well, like, the best I one, think about it, but I'm telling you here, I'm going to use it, but I don't. The best one, the best one was the one that Tracy picked up on right away was when I said, she's going to pick up the one on the left. Who's she? Were <laughs> <laughs> like, you a little tired? Or oh, she's going to pick up the one on the left. I was dying laughing. I was like, oh my God, what's wrong with me? She said, who's she? Oh. I'm like, who is she? You mean me? That yeah. was the, like the one. Uh, who's the the Irish? Is that Catherine? Catherine? No. Um, or Janet? More, more. Oh, Moira. 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 Uh, where she said, I glittered that thing within an inch of its life. <laughs> right. <laughs> I was like, what? Hi, Danielle. Oh my God! Hi, Danielle. What's up? Hi, hi, hi. All right. So now that one can go get glued on. Right there, like that. And then where's my bottom one? Right here. Don't freak out, girl. This one's going to, that's not something, some, what, oh, don't, oh my gosh, I was about to lose my mind. <laughs> I was like, I know I did it right this time. Come on. Don't freak me out. All right, this has to come down a little, just a little. I'm like cutting my paper within an inch of its life. I'm like, I'm not leaving myself any room here. <laughs> All right, that'll work. All right, let's get some glue on here. Then we can go sew. Oh, Cam's home now. That was just... I just got done saying garage door, Cam. I opened your mail because I knew it was my speaker. Oh. That's why you had like a major brain fart and figure out the correct combo to go in the garage. Oh, jeez. I had the right numbers. It's not in the right order. Oh, yeah, I got to remember to show you. I have to have my mom send a picture, but the two resin things, the chime and the clock. Oh, yeah. Holy cow, they turned out amazing. Dude, the clock light bulb from last beautiful. year. Come on. Still didn't get one. <laughs> Did you hear that? <laughs> Girl's like, the light bulb from last year. She's like, I still didn't get one. Still a good one. I love that one. That was awesome. All right. So that's that page. So now I'm going to go sew because I want it stitched here and here and here. So there's one page done that only took me, what, two hours to think of that? 
hot dog. Oh, jeez. Oh, man. Now I got the Mickey Mouse flying on my head. What? I can't sing in a copyright. Well, you can't sing it, but you can say the name of it. The Mickey Mouse song. Oh. Am I? <clears throat> right. No. No? The cartoon one? one. About the hot dog and Goofy dancing off. Oh, on that. right. Diggity, whatever. Yeah, that right? one. Oh, that drives me. I will have that in my head all day, too. Oh, uh, the one that say it says Mishka Mushka. Would that says Mishka's name in it? Correct. Yeah. It says Mishka's name in it. That's yes, so weird. Yes, it does. Mishka Mushka. Yep. Yep. Blank mouse. Yep. <laughs> blank mouth. Yeah. I can't say his name. That blank mouse. Yes. I don't want to get dinged for saying the word. <laughs> but the first time I heard it, because Cam used to watch it when she was little. I'm like, well, okay, how did they get Mishka's name? Come on now. Just like Andrina's name, mm -hmm. I mixed Adriana and Irina together to get her name. So she was big into the Little Mermaid when she was little. And in this, the book, I, I, ha I think you hear it in the movie too. One of uh, Ariel's sister's name was Andrina. And it was spelt exactly the same way. I'm like, are you flipping kidding me? Really? <laughs> yeah. I don't like that. I don't like that lace. Maybe you ready to get off? Oh, I'm just crafting as if we're not live. You know, I'm just going with the flow here. I know what I'm doing, too. Uh, I can't stop now because, you know, you guys started this rabbit trail, so now I'm stuck on it. I have to go potty. Oh, go potty. But, yeah, you can go off and then go potty, and then we can, you know. We can still craft. Right. We can still craft. We just won't bore everybody by just sitting here like, oh, nobody's yeah. talking. Just got home from work and I'm off for the next three days. You go, Danielle, because I'm yeah. in vacation. Happy Let me New know. Year, Danielle. I'm Merry okay. Christmas. There's your present. Enjoying not having to get up and go to work. Taking full advantage right. of that. I finished oh, I'm the I'm staying up till three in the morning every day. Ladies, we're going to get off here. Uh, again, I appreciate the support for the last uh, six years. I hope y'all hang out with me on my seventh year of YouTube. Happy anniversary. Yep. Happy anniversary. anniversary. You too, Dad. Yeah, happy anniversary. Anniversary. Oh, my gosh. Happy anniversary to you too, Deb. Yeah. Thanks. It's for Deb too. Deb, you're five years. I'm going on my seventh. I'm just finished four. So, yeah, starting five. Starting five, and nice. I'm starting seven. So, there you go. It's been a pleasure meeting everyone. I love it. I've had so much fun. Um, Laurel and Debbie, thank you for coming on with me. And ladies, I hope that you have a very, very happy, happy new year. Be safe. Please be safe. Yes. And have fun. We're just going to sit here and pray craft. Yep. <laughs> That's what we're going to do. Okay, bye. 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 Wow, that was in stereo, y'all. <laughs>